what's up everybody so as you can see i'm recording on playstation now but i'm doing the audio for my voice on the computer so if it it's if it's just slightly off i do apologize for it but since it's halloween and we're playing as toxic killers i figure there's nothing more toxic than let's get rid of pagos louise then obviously offering up red mores because that's what we're doing today but also we're going to run no one escapes death because i believe with the recent patch that dead by daylight did they may have fixed the healing boon totem i'm not sure but just in case survivors are no longer cleansing totems so we're going to punish them for it. we're going to remind them that totems still need to be cleansed and that you're not going to be able to use them any kind of way that you want so while we're waiting on this match, let's go for our add-ons and perks really quick. So I'll just leave them up on the screen for you so that you can read on them. So I guess not a bad um, map for hexes. Oh, we didn't even offer one though, so it doesn't matter. Oh, we found one person. Maybe we can get a grab on him. But we will, as the time calls for. Uh, uh, yeah, this is where Hex Blood Flavor would come in because, I mean, it wouldn't have worked there because she dropped the pallet on me, but. Uh, gotcha. You gonna still run this loop? No, she's not good. Ah, nice dead heart. But unfortunately, this loop is very weak for you, so it won't work out in your favor. And you won't make it to that pallet either. Ah! Woo! That was close. I'm not gonna lie. That was very close. Alright, right, we're already at the four stacks. We've got two quick hooks before they got in the generator done, so we are off to the good start. She wasted the spread first. And, uh... Well, I don't know why she would go for the same window and just not a different one, but nonetheless, we got her. and trigger her decisive strike to see if we got it. Uh, we definitely want the pallets to drop and everything. 
not have a uh, ball time or just use a decisive strike. I didn't think they would, and that's a long step. This is the Alright, let's go see if anybody got saved. There's Kate. Oh wow. I didn't realize that, that that's a thing anyway. Even if I turn around. I guess they just don't want to be moored, and that's fine because you're just saving me the third chase. I mean, the moor is just the thing that we're doing for the event. Alright, but. Uh, next time, I'm probably gonna need my weapon. Alright, kill a Jack Blue. She did mess up. We messed up too. I'm not sure how we missed the. But we did. Let's so. close this distance. I think she knew. I actually think she did the pause of too. She maybe. She, may be, she, may be, she didn't. I really do believe that this is a swift though because they're not going for rescues and I think they're just trying to avoid getting more. Well, like I said, that's fine by me. That's just something extra that we were trying to do for the event. I 
hope you don't think that Steve's gonna run the crawl on the generator that I've left either. They're still close enough to where he won't. He won't be able to get out though. Even if he cleanses, no one escapes death. It doesn't matter. So maybe he'll just let the entity take him. I'm not sure what his plan is going to be. If he sees me, which he likely does, because I'm just running around, he knows he's not going to get out. Ah! You thought you were going to get a second hit, didn't you? Uh -huh. No, sir. Uh -huh. The last one alive, he doesn't get the chance to get off the hook. and now race. So yeah, that'll be it for this video. So just check back in a few hours for the next one and I will catch you guys in that. So we're back with the second video of the day, but this time we're going to be doing Huntress. We already have a build pre-set up, but it may all turn depending on the survivors that we get because I'm not sure about the add-ons if I want to keep them or not. some flashlight to toolboxes <sighs> you know I do get tired of running from the demise when I just have items running around here so it's too easy for them we should run hex no one escapes death because we are trying to be as toxic as possible for the Halloween series but I really really don't want to do that, but I will if I have to um, well, we lost one survivor, so let's see what we get. So in the meantime, let's just look at our add-on. the side of what we want. Okay. Oh. Okay. Some of these, I believe, are new. I think they may have, um... I think we'll be fine with these add-ons. Okay, so we only have one toolbox and one flashlight, so we can change Franklin's lines back out. And let's use... We have a Mori. Let's use the Natophobia just to kind of get some more game slowdown. Ah, uh, I tried to hit triangle just in time. But yeah, we're going to use the Natophobia to try to get some more game slowdown, but we have... Dying light, I believe, as well. I so, all right. So while this is loading, I will see you guys when it starts. All right. So, not bad actually. We we might be able to 
We might be able to make something work. We're gonna take the chance to just go on this side of the rack because that's where the most generators are. It looks like it's only two over here. Oh, not one. Oh, that's because she could hear the humming immediately. She's gonna run to a loop, which we expect. Very far. We don't act like we don't see this person in here. Wow, they were working together on that one. They had to be. Oh, I think she's in that locker. Let's check it. saw that you saw the little blip. Oh, I messed up my aim twice. This is much easier to do on PC. Survivor, so let's go ahead and build on this momentum. Whoa! Uh, I couldn't get the wind up for the hatchet like I really wanted to. Let's get him up. This is the closest one. I thought she was going to break more to the left, so I didn't really to the left. Alright, so we're just going to hook him here since we've already started the wave of the Let's get him here because we know the other side is over there now. too far honestly because there's no reason there's no reason for us to cross the map because we've got two people on the hub we've already cut their supplies in half yeah nothing's being left on over here and we can honestly pinch them if they come this way okay so that person died on the hook and that person was on stage two so already they're off to a horrible start further though because she's not um wiggling now she is and the hatch was supposed to spawn in killer shack i did forget to say that that um somebody offered up for the hatch to spawn in killer shack so we don't have to worry about it being over here basically we should stay here this Everybody got one hook? No, one person got hit twice because they got two. But already this is getting over. Maybe you can make 
before we move on to another killer so let's load into well let's wait till the survivors load into a lobby and we'll just go from there Alright, so immediately I think that these people are playing together because three of them loaded in at the exact same time, so we do need to account for that. Um, let's see. I don't think we need to change our perks. I think we'll still be fine with what we've got. Well, we'll just get the up and see what happens. So I will catch you guys when the match actually starts. still managed to end up on my least favorite map in the entire game but it's nice and open though so it should work in the huntress's favor but this is also the problem because visibility is so low did i just See, this is why we, we we're gonna run no one escapes death because now they're not gonna cleanse any totems. But somebody just created a boon totem. Probably that in the cave. And I'm willing to almost bet that it was the one that heals because I think it got reactivated in the recent patch. Somebody's here. So I'm, sometimes I do actually legitimately miss my gadget goals, but sometimes I'm also trying to change their direction before they can go anywhere. Destroy. Shouldn't have done it though. Should have just it back over here, but we decided we wanted to get points. Right, if we take an angle, we can kind of cut where they can go. Got her. I don't know that we were supposed to be She was already through the window. 
But we're still making good progress. We're just trading hooks at this point. We didn't get the... Well, she did heal her, actually. Kayla, she's healed now. Is that, um... I wonder if that's Object of Obsession. And that's why I can see her. So the one one person went that way. We saw the Michaela all the way out there. I wonder if she's... No, she's not working that generator. We actually have a nice little three gen here that we can keep. For. There's our obsession, Nancy. But we definitely want to hit her with hatchets. that generator so let's check over there first Save the best, save the best for last token. So, but we're still only at two because we're not mouse one for anybody. Oh, 
she Definitely want to keep these three generators here. So, oh, they only need one more. So yeah, they gotta come over. Mm. Look at that. Exploring and kill. isn't the worst thing for them. We're halfway there. Chase her, she allows the others to do work on the generators. We are working on all three now though, that's a problem. So we're gonna have to down somebody quickly and put pressure. This one's barely started though, so we're not gonna worry about that one yet. We're gonna get a pump of the diesel because of this thing, so this works out. shape despite three people being alive and a lot of that is because they all freed themselves so badly. I don't have any more hatches. But we're gonna we're gonna go into this chase. And 
game because they have so little progress on the game. Oh wow. Yep. Tyler said she couldn't drop it. But you kill her. Take a little bit longer than what it's supposed to. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, this one's being worked on though. Like she also had the shadow step one, so she probably created both. But nonetheless, GG's to them, but we're moving on to the next killer. 